Um, this one read from um, 1 Corinthians 14 and verse 1, um, which reads like this, Pursue love and desire spiritual gifts, but especially that you may prophesy. Okay. Pursue love, desire spiritual gifts, but especially that you may prophesy. So uh, this is a check for uh, all of us, instruction for all of us, as we begin to reflect and look and see, you know, in light of this verse, am I actually uh, pursuing love? Am I desiring spiritual gifts and uh, desiring, desiring spiritual gifts? And especially, am I desiring that I might prophesy or speak forth as moved by the Holy Spirit, speak forth as inspired by the Holy Spirit, right? Uh, in my speaking, in my ministering, right? So this is a, you know, kind of a check for us, uh, for us to really reflect and see, you know, am I doing this in my life? Right. And um, and we can just pray and ask the Lord, yeah, Lord, um, I just want to, I want to do this. I want to pursue love, the character of God, the nature of God. Uh, I want to, um, you know, uh, let this God kind of love, agape, be expressed in my ministering, be expressed in my uh, interactions, right? Um, secondly, Lord, may I have that passionate zeal. We all studied that. We we all learned that this word, the Greek word zelo, which means uh, you know, you're used in a negative context, it means strong desire, even like lust. So, is that the passionate desire of our hearts? You know, um, well, uh, is that there all the time? Is it there? Um, we need to check. We need to ask. If it's not there, you know why? You know, why not? Um, have we cooled off in the pursuit of God? Did something happen? Was there a compromise? You know, um, was there some hurt or whatever? You know, whatever be the reason. Because this is scripture. You know, this is scriptural exhortation that you pursue love, go after Christ likeness, at the same time desire spiritual gifts. Um, for us to really be red hot, passionate about that, because it's the expression of the Holy Spirit, right? Uh, the gifts are a manifestation of the Spirit. So um, do I have that intense desire for the Holy Spirit to manifest these gifts in me and through me? Right? And uh, the thing is, especially that we may prophesy, especially that we may speak forth as the oracles of God, right? That we may not speak out of our own resources, but you know, as the Holy Spirit uh, puts His Word in our hearts, as there is a rich deposit of His Word, in our hearts, and as the Holy Spirit quickens these, that we will understand that way. Right. So let's pray. Father, we, we thank you for this uh, reminder that we can look back on, reflect, and see in our own lives of Father God, Lord, whether, we, whether we are pursuing love. Lord, in all those situations, Father God, in all those maybe uh, difficulties, challenges, uh, with difficult people, Lord, with our own, um, Lord, in our own household, Father God, Lord, are we pursuing love? Master, we, we ask, O oh God, that uh, let there be a, Lord, of, um, an outpouring, Father God, of love, Lord, for the unlovable Master. Lord, we thank you that uh, through your Holy Spirit, you have poured out uh, the, the love that comes from you into our hearts. And may these find expression, Lord, uh, through our lives, Father God, through our motives, attitudes, conversations, choices, Lord, responses to people, everything, Lord. And I just pray, Father God, that um, that we will, Lord, desire, have a strong desire for the work of the Holy Spirit in our lives, for the work of the Holy Spirit through our lives, in thought and word and action and, and the gifts, Lord, that we would just pursue that, Father God. May we never stop pursuing, God. May we never stop desiring. May we never stop, oh God, for a greater level, oh God, for a greater level of um, Lord, manifestation of your gifts, Father God, of yourself, oh God. Yes, Lord, we thank you. And Lord, that we may speak forth as we are moved by your Spirit as we are inspired by your spirit, that we may, Lord, take every opportunity to, uh, Lord, to hear from you, God. Lord, maybe uh, sharpen our hearing, oh God. Lord, even as your word says, let him who has ears hear what the spirit of God is saying. 
let him who has an ear hear what the Spirit of God is saying, Lord, now. Lord, sharpen our spiritual ears, open our spiritual ears, God, open our spiritual eyes, Lord, to see you, hear you, to receive from you, Master. We thank you, Lord. We bless your name. We bless your name, Father God. I just pray, Lord, even as you've called us to be spokespersons, God, that we may do so in this manner, Lord, um, pursuing love and desiring spiritual gifts and prophesying, Father God. May we do this. May we, Lord, communicate, may we proclaim the truth of your kingdom. May we, Lord, in all our communication, may we point to you and draw people to you, God. Yes, Lord, we thank you. In Jesus' matchless name, we pray. Amen. Amen. Okay, so uh, I just wanted to uh, talk to us and also kind of get a uh, get your thoughts. Uh, how, how are things? Uh, have you gone back to that topic? Uh, do you remember what the topic is? Okay, so maybe just, uh, you know, I'll just quickly um, share that screen uh, with all of us so that we know um, the topics that we have um, actually uh, confirmed. Okay, let me just share that. Okay, I hope you can see this, right? Um, okay, it's come up. So Isaac, Isaac Vandy, uh, sermon title is Youths and Violence. Probably you should make it Youth and Violence, uh, singular. Um, and um, okay, Subhashish is uh, saved to save others. You can even make it save to save. That would be nice, catchy. John Paul, Zoe, the God kind of life. Okay, then Elisha, um, the second of second coming of Jesus, I think. Okay, maybe you can change it here, Elisha, the second coming of Jesus. Um, Georgia. Um, okay, let me just see if how many of you are here in the first place. Okay, um, some of us are here, some of us are not. Okay, anyway, just let me just go through even if they, you know, watch the video a little later. So Georgia is uh, stewarding your rebound. Um, then Enoch success is a wasted life. Zelitoli, um, how to cast off demons. I think that's a double F over there, off. How to, how to cast off demons like Jesus. Um, then Rosalind is perfect love, casts out fear. Then Jeffina is a special purpose. Okay. Um, well, if you if you want to change the title, uh, you have access to it, like all of us have. So you could do it uh, maybe today, tomorrow, uh, Maybe this weekend, but not later than that, please. Right till end of day Sunday, you can take time to uh, change the title, rework the title, you know, like kind of refine it, but not later than okay, later than that. Okay, Aradhana uh, Kamble is um, persecution in the early church. Then Linden is why, how, when. Um, okay, so. Uh, that's not very explanatory, uh, the title, but it's uh, definitely intriguing. Um, so, yeah, you could go with that. Paul, uh, hindrances to revivals and restorations. Then Leah Lama is turning point, never be the same. And Abu Bakr is uh, the testimonies of waiters. Okay, interesting title. Um, and Isaiah 40, 31, very nice. Um, Lubega, Colin, is, um, are you ready for the king's audit? Are you ready, I guess? Are we ready, if you want to change it to that? Are we ready for the king's audit? Are you ready for the king's audit? So so th those are um, 16, right? 16 titles, 16 people who have come forward to share. So, um, so we will start from next, um, from Tuesday onwards, right? Tuesday. Uh, we will have, so you will have about, um, okay, I'm, I'm just going to put it here, but I will also put it in the stream. So online class and the e-learning will have 12 minutes um, to share. Okay. 12 minutes is your sermon. So uh, whatever you want to share from that um, title, you take 12 minutes to do that. Okay, So you finish it. There will be a timer, and um, 
when there's one minute to go, maybe maybe at the end of uh, start of the twelfth minute or uh, end of eleven minutes. Um, um, sorry, uh, yeah, end of eleven minutes. I will just um, um, you know give a reminder. Then you can finish it within a minute. Okay, so at the end of twelve minutes, I'll probably mute your mic so you know that twelve minutes are done. Right. So, but you can also keep a um, timer. Maybe you can on your phone or whatever, and you'll, it'll be easy for you to just time yourself. But but practice that. Right? Uh, practice whatever you want to share within that twelve minutes. Okay. Um, yeah. Time yourself. Try it out. Um, let's also uh, put together whatever you know in the sermon construction or sermon outline construction. Um, whatever we have shared so far, let's try to. You know, work that. Let's try to put it in practice. And um, so, once you uh, you know you share the message, uh, kindly upload your sermon outline in the stream, right? Um, so I, I hope you know how to do that. So you can upload the sermon outline in the stream. Um, those of you who are watching, I mean, watching this video probably in the e-learning class, there will be a separate set of instructions for you on the e-learning discussion. Right, um, which will be uploaded um, at the end of. Uh, by the time you watch this video, it will be uploaded on how to take the video. Uh, you so you will be basically shooting uh, a video or making a video of the message, of you sharing the message, and you will be uploading it right um, on, on a Google Drive and sending me the link. Um, so I will give a detailed instruction on how to do that, and um, and so on. So you'll you'll you can go with that, right? Okay. So the others um, who are on online class, uh, a few things here. So you have twelve minutes. You can use um, now. This applies to both e-learning and online. You can use um, your, a, a PowerPoint. Right? So you can try it out. Uh, I, I would uh, suggest that you make a PowerPoint and uh, but just convert it into a PDF, right? You save the PowerPoint file as a PDF. Um, it'll be easier for you to actually just go through. Um, but you can use a PowerPoint also, PowerPoint presentation also. That's fine. Um, um, yeah. So, uh, like we saw the TED Talk videos, we saw how impactful the PowerPoint is, uh, provided. We don't crowd it, saturate it with the, too much text, right? So be mindful of that. You know, we saw those videos which were really impactful, which had visuals, which had text, but it was just to enhance the talk, right? So um, you just be mindful of that. Don't cover the entire screen with text. It'll be difficult for people to read, um, and uh, we, we don't want to do that, OK? Um, you know, the other thing is also like, um, um, to speak into, uh, I mean, to look into the camera. Now, it's. Um, I, I hope your internet is okay wherever you are. Um, so just try that out. Make sure that you're at, in a in a you know like a plain background or something which is minimal, like uh, where I am right now. So there's nothing distracting. There are no people walking past, or there's no noise um in the background right so so just wanted to ask you know is everyone okay with that you know uh from the time like this it'll be this hour right normally uh indian time 11 to 11 50. um so i don't know what um, environment you are in and uh, you know what time it is in your country around that time so but i just want to know you know can you do that Right? Can you make sure that you are in an environment where it's quiet uh, or not too much noise, ambient noise, and um, where uh, the internet is okay and you know we, you can make the presentation? Right? Um, so uh, yeah, Elisha, Lubega, Leah Lama, Prezi, you know, any problems with this? Any challenges? Um, you, know, you can let me know. Is there anything? Um, I just want to ask if it's 12 minutes for each person. Yeah. Uh, so it will go on for like three classes, right? Yes. Okay. If it's OK, then I'm OK. Yeah. <laughs> so it's. Uh, so yeah. how will I know when is my turn, when is others okay. so, turn? Yeah, yeah. So we start from 8th November. OK. So um, 
8th november then we have uh, we do not have a class on 10th november but we will have a class on 15th november 10th november we don't have a class so it's 8th november 15th november 17th november and the last one on the 12th to 22nd of november okay so that's um four sessions um yeah so lubega so is, is that okay that's uh, fine so we'll have 12 minutes each um okay lubega asked the question is the presentation going to be live or recorded so it's going to be live uh, lubega it's not recorded for the online students it is live so how we you know come into this class just like how you are right now so you will unmute your mic you will um, uh, switch on your camera and then you will present so it's going to be live um and uh, okay rosalyn you can't switch on your video you don't have um, any problem with that rosalyn uh, um. noise is it okay ambient noise okay um okay just see if it's for the 12 minutes if you can manage or probably you know for that particular uh, yeah yeah okay okay so what i'll do is um, see I, I i actually thought it won't be nice if i just give a list and say okay this day this person um uh well we could do that but actually i want everybody to be there for all the sessions so you can get to see how everybody is presenting um and you can also learn from that as well so um okay let me just give me some time let me just think and then present because uh, in earlier sessions you would just randomly pick okay there's an online actually picker i just put the names and then it'll just an arrow which goes around and then rests at one name and then we pick that person so we, we used to do that um so we could do that but yeah but if, if it's you know if the your environment is going to be noisy and you need to for that particular day you need to make some changes etc that's fine i can actually you know we can pick some dates and say okay these four people are presenting um but the problem is if you don't show up on that day then you don't get to present um you know uh, that's the thing you know and four people are ready and the other four maybe someone is not there maybe two people are not there two people are there and then you know we need two more people to present on that day we don't want to waste that time right so that's the thing so um it'll be great if everybody is prepared okay, right from next tuesday is everybody is prepared you just you know tell yourself okay i'm going to i'm i'll be presenting today okay so you just prepare but i will also uh, you know put out that list right so um that's the thing so uh, any anybody apart from rosalyn who has a challenge with ambient noise ambient sound by that i mean you know there you're in a place where there is a lot going on maybe there's traffic um anybody else has that issue everyone else is okay elisha you're okay Yes, Subhash, yes, yes, yeah, okay, great, great, Elisha. So, Subhashish, you also, okay. So, what I'll do is, uh, Subhashish, Rosalind, maybe, you know, we'll just pick a day and uh, you guys will stick to that day, right? So, that day, you can just make sure, you can plan ahead, make sure that, um, you know, you can, um, you can just uh, be in a setting where there's, you can plan to be in a place where there's um, low noise or no noise and you can do that, right? Okay, so maybe Rosalind and Shubhashish can go day one. Okay, so you can maybe next Tuesday, you guys can do it. I'll put out the list on the stream and the date. Okay, but we need to stick to it, right? Okay, so we have we are eight, fifteen, seventeen, and twenty-two, and if need be, we'll go into twenty-four. But I'm hoping that we won't need to do that. Okay. Um. Okay. So any questions? Any doubts, any questions? Okay. Yes, um, Lubega. Yes, Pastor. I'm asking. Yeah. 
shall we also share when we are seated or we shall need to stand up? But you can be seated. Not a problem. Okay. Okay. Yeah, because I think that will be is, most comfortable. Yeah. Yeah. You'll be using a, uh, your phone or your laptop. So I think you just sit and do it. That's fine. Thank you, sir. Yeah, most welcome. Okay. Um, any other questions? Anything that... Um... Okay. Right. Okay, so I think, uh, yeah, that's that's it. That, those, those are some things that I just wanted to share um, in this session, and uh, we can close. So we'll start from next uh, Tuesday onwards, which is 8th, right? Okay, if there are no questions, we'll, uh, we'll close. Right. Thank you. Thank you for being here. God bless. Bye-bye.